Where have you been? Chicago. You could have called. I never asked if you were dead. I mean, I thought you might be, but I never said the words. The phones were out. Hmm? The phones. They were dead. In Chicago. Hmm? In all of Chicago, the phones were dead. In the place where I was. For four weeks, the phones were dead? Why didn't you just go someplace else? I couldn't. Where did you go? Why didn't you tell me? I couldn't. Who are you? I wake up six in the morning and you're not there. I call your work and you're not there. I call your brother and you're not there. I even called the police. I never asked if you were dead, not once. I mean, I thought you might be, but I never said the words. I'm not dead. I wish you were. I'm not. Where did you go? Chicago. Why? For love. Who is she? Who? Who is it? Who do you love? No one. Well, myself. You love yourself. Why didn't you just masturbate? No, I love the theater. I acted in a show. And you don't love me. I just came to get my stuff. Milo! You flew a thousand miles to Chicago to act in a fucking show? It was awesome. And you couldn't tell me. Oh, Barb, you wouldn't understand. The lights, the crowd, the people staring up at me like I was King Henry VIII. It was amazing. What show was it? King Henry VIII. I don't understand you. I knew you wouldn't, Barb. That's why I didn't call. Your brother thought you were dead. My brother is dead. Inside. He doesn't know how to live. Oh, and you do. Now. You piece of shit. Watch it. I'll chop your head off. What? King Henry VIII would have chopped his wife's head off if she had talked to him like that. You... You're not Henry VIII. But I was, Barb. For four weeks I was Henry VIII. By God, I was good. Why, Milo? Why would you do this to me? You never even liked acting. I love acting. How do you think I put up with you all these years? Milo. You don't know what it's like, Barbara. You just don't. What about your job? What about it? Fixing air conditioners? Do these look like air conditioner hands? These are regal hands. These are the hands of a king. They don't belong inside of an air conditioner with a screwdriver and a quarter inch nut. These hands control the fate of a nation for four weeks. Four beautiful fucking weeks. Freon can kiss my ass. You have lost your mind. That's not all I've lost. Where's your ring? I sold it. You sold For headshots. Those things are expensive. You sold the ring? I'm, I'm gonna be an actor, Barb. I've decided. I'm gonna move to Chicago and I'm gonna be an actor. I'm gonna do Shakespeare and Mehmet and this French guy I met named Valto who writes avant-garde stuff that doesn't make any sense, but it's got a lot of curses in it. And I'm gonna get a flat with an actress named Sally and a poster of Amadeus on the wall. And I'm gonna drink cappuccinos till my piss turns brown and foamy. Oh my God, Barb, I've never been this happy in all my life. An actress named Sally? Oh. Just a friend. She's really nice. But what about me? Me? You can be friends with her too. I'll introduce you. No. Why don't you move in with me? I'm your wife. I thought you didn't like Chicago. I don't. Then... Milo. I have a hole in my chest. The size of a walnut. And every time I think of you, it gets bigger. And bigger, and bigger, until the whole goddamn bottle of Seagram's is gone. And I look at your pillow, and there are no children. 
and there's nobody. Milo, I can't stop crying. You want to know the truth? Yes. I met someone. You fucking asshole! Her name is Sally. Sally Struthers. From TV? No, it's... The one with all the colored children. Who keeps eating all their food. No, it's not that, Sally Struthers. This one was good looking. And young, and skinny. And she doesn't even know any colored children. And she comes into my shop because she needs her air conditioner fixed. Because she was driving all the way to Chicago. And as I was fixing her air conditioner, she's telling about these shows she's doing. And they need someone to play Henry VIII. And... I just left. I didn't know what to tell you, so I didn't call. So I went to Chicago with Sally Struthers, and I auditioned for the part. And oh, you should have seen me. I, I blew them out of their goddamn seats. And I got it. And I was so good. When I think about it, I get chills. And there was Sally, staring up at me as if I was the last man on earth as if she existed solely for my happiness, my satisfaction. And afterwards, she made love to me like I was a king and she was my concubine. And right then and right there, that's where I knew I wanted to be with my life. Making love to Sally Struthers. I gave you the best years of my life. They were nice, but I wish you were dead. I will be, Barb. Just let me get my stuff and I'll disappear again. It'll be like I just passed away. Just vanished into the cold blue night. You can't have your stuff. Hmm? You can't have it. Not until you give me back my life. Look, Barb, I... I want my life back. And I don't have it. It's in your heart. No. It's in your heart, Milo. That's where my life is. Well, mine's in Chicago. That's where my life is. Ah, oh, fuck it. What? Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. Fuck your life, fuck my heart. Where is it? It's nowhere. It's on the stage, Barbara. That's where my life is. It's on the stage, in the bright lights of Chicago. I love you. No. I love you, you son of a bitch. You, you love someone else. Who? You don't, Who else? You don't love me, Milo, the actor. You, you only love Milo, the handyman, the AC guy. You don't love me. I'm Henry VIII, baby. You don't even know me. Milo. Just pretend I'm dead. I practically am. Milo. Dead. I love you. I'm sorry. Just let me get my stuff. Milo? I already sold your stuff. Barb, where's my stuff? Your brother came and got it. Frankie took my stuff? He sold it for a couple hundred dollars. Frankie sold my stuff? We thought you were dead. Frankie sold my stuff? We thought you were dead. I don't have a place to live and you sell all my stuff? You live in Chicago. I need that money, Barb. What money? The money you got from selling my stuff. I, I could have got a couple thousand, but, but even if it's just a couple well, hundred... I couldn't pay the rent. So you sell all my stuff? The police said you were dead. Do I look dead to you? The police said you were dead. They found your car abandoned. And so you sold all my stuff? I couldn't pay the rent. This is unbelievable. I have your pillow and your toothbrush. I need that money, Barb. Frankie said it would be best. Frankie is a fuckhead. He said it would be best. What are you doing? I'm calling Frankie out. Get a goddamn answering machine. I'm going over there. Milo, don't. What? Don't go over there. 
Frankie's not the same. He's changed somehow. I'm going over there. I slept with him, you know. While you were gone, I slept with him. We thought that you were dead, so I slept with him. And then you sold all my stuff. Frankie said it would be best. 